Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a newer Gear Sun. It was introduced at SHOT Show. It was released a couple months ago. You're starting to see more reviews on it. It's showing up at the local gun store. It's certainly available online. And this is it. It comes in this hard case. It replaces the MC9. And they call it the Disruptor. So what is the MC9 Disruptor? Well, here it is. The reason they went with that name Disruptor, MC9 Disruptor, is because they say this gun will disrupt the industry with everything that it offers at a budget price. So let's check it out. If you go with this, you'll get this hard case, two additional back straps, a punch, a takedown, well, not a takedown, a hex wrench, because it is optic ready. Here we've got a board brush, a lock, and paperwork that I already removed. But here is the Disruptor. It has this camo pattern. This is the OD Green model. You may have seen it in black, and it's a little bit different. I think that's kind of cool that it's different. Cerakoted throughout polymer frame striker fire handgun that has a threaded barrel. It comes with one 17 round magazine many people say every handgun should come with at least two magazines well no argument here but the cost stays down when they only include one so the cost is down on this i'm going to talk about that but a 17 round magazine and a full three finger contact on the grip the slide looks kind of cool the, the od green finish is uh, more pronounced with the camo than the black finish so that that's one way that you'll see the camo a little better is with the od green models and that's what this is it is optic ready if you go with an optic on here it will have a shield sms footprint but when you take the cover plate off the rear sight is attached so you do lose the rear sights. If you don't go with an optic, you can see these are very low profile sights. Very low profile. Three dot sights and they are all metal. It has a 4.6 inch threaded barrel and I'm still waiting on my can so I'll be able to shoot this suppressed. But it's also left handed friendly. You can see the slide stop on both sides as well as the magazine release, which can be switched over to the right side of the pistol, making it completely left-handed friendly. I mentioned it has two additional back straps. There it is. The one installed is the medium size. Fits my hands quite well. No argument there. Has a little undercut in the trigger guard. Square trigger guard. A lot of room in there to insert your finger. It is unloaded. I'm measuring the trigger a bit on the heavy side, right around six and a quarter pounds. It has a distinct wall there. There's the reset. A wall and then it breaks. No over travel at all. We'll take a look at the reset once again. Not bad, a little bit heavier. But that's all right. It has a three-slot Picatinny rail and some forward serrations that are basically like pads on the slide. All right, for those press checks, want to make sure you have a rounder there. You can do that. It has a sight hole indicator on the top of the slide. All right, and a cocked striker indicator. So, so long as the pistol has been charged, that will show red. And then when it's no longer charged, that red goes away. So it, it, it has its safeties in there, as well as a trigger safety right there, that blade right inside the trigger. Overall, nice handgun. It has a nice feel to it. It's called the Disruptor, and you're wondering, how much is it? Well, the MSRP is $394. And you're seeing them online for right around... 350 so it, it offers a budget price that is pretty cool we disassemble the handgun here we have a steel guide rod captured recoil spring 4.6 inch barrel i have to take the thread cap off to take that out so i'll just leave it in there 
you don't need me to do that and then you can see the little trigger plunger there now when I put it back together see how it moves that lever up a little bit you want to keep it vertical so that you can go ahead and reset that takedown lever but it's a decent looking pistol it has a nice overall feel I do plan to get an optic on there but I will lose the rear sights so you have to make sure you have fresh batteries and and your optic when you do that let's take a look at the trigger once again because it's breaking right around six and a quarter pounds on average with a reset right there the Gearson MC9 Disruptor. This replaced the Gearson MC9. So this is the Disruptor model. This is the one they're, they're pushing now. They say this one has it all. Plus it looks pretty cool. So it's available right around 350 bucks. It offers a lot for the money. You probably have to go out and get yourself another 17 round mag though. But this is the newest from Gearson. And I think a lot of people will certainly dig that price and the features it offers. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.